Hello everybody, welcome to my channel, The Real Super Sam. Today is another comic review and I hope you enjoy. Today I'm reviewing Fantastic Four Annual 2 with Doctor Doom as the main villain, titled The Final Victory of Doctor Doom. Doctor Doom has been saved from space from Ramatut after his last plan failed in issue 23. Doom survived because of an oxygen tank in his mask. Ramatut saved Doom for curiosity and they both find out the Fantastic Four are both of their greatest enemies, and then they think that Doom and Roma Tut are the same person, just Tut is from the future, so he decides to drop Doctor Doom back on Earth. Anyway, this part really confused me at first as a kid, because I knew Roma Tut was really King the Conqueror in the future, or past, whatever, so now him and Doom aren't the same person, but I'm pretty sure they are related. Anyway, moving on, Doom's plan is to invite the Fantastic Four to an honorary party for them in Latveria, and during there, he gives them some drinks, all but Mr. Fantastic drink from them, and the three others that do, later see things that would make them the maddest at each other, leading to the four members fighting each other. Dr. Doom gets figured out though, and he runs away to New York from Latveria and into the Baxter building, where he challenges Mr. Fantastic to a one-on-one -on -one brain match. Whoever's mind is greater will win, and the other will be destroyed. And as you can see here, the second to last page ends with Dog Doom victorious. He's so happy he'd have proved superior to Mr. Fantastic, he just leaves. Oh, of course Reed Richards really won. What he did was use Doom's own illusion drink on him and make him think of that victory to leave until next time. Sometimes in the early days, Doom was funny dumb, at least to me. Also, also later, he becomes so enjoyably funny evil. I mean, look at his face, this face he makes from issue 16. I always remembered it because it looked so funny to me. Again, this annual has full pages of the supervillains the FF have fought in between issues 18 through 30. Again, these three are my favorite ones. Then, there's four giant full page artworks for each member, and my favorite one is for The Thing. He's definitely the funniest member of the FF. Actually, reading early Fantastic Four and Spider-Man, I think Thing is funnier than Spider-Man back in the early 60s. Crazy. And if you are wondering, the Yancey Street Gang are like the worst neighborhood in the New York and FF comics. Actually, to open up the whole annual, there is a short story on Dr. Doom's origin. His dad was a gypsy healer, and when he was called by the king to save his wife's life, which was impossible to do, he sort of tricked the king to escape with his son Victor Doom. Eventually, he died because of the king, and Dr. Doom vowed revenge on mankind for it. But even as a kid, his father apparently knew of Doom's darkness, since his mom was a witch. Later in life, he finds his mom's witchcraft and studies it. He becomes ruler of Latveria and a very smart and an evil genius and eventually becomes the great Doctor Doom. His face is hideously scarred because of a lap accident in college, so he makes an identity of Doctor Doom covering his face with a metal mask. They actually don't have a good reason to why he hates Reed so much in here. At least there's no reason he should hate Reed more than anyone else. In the main story, there's a moment where we see Doom use his secret ring on one of his fingers to be able to take out his mask off, and when he does, his real face, it gets, shocks him so much that he gets mad and he's, that he's still so hideous that he smashes the mirror he's looking at, alerting the Fantastic Four to his presence, ruining his master plan. I like how he ruins the plan himself, like he's the only reason the Fantastic Four won today, even though he was the one tricking them in the first place. Ironic. I liked this more than the first annual, it wasn't as long though, but Dr. Doom was much cooler than the Submariner. Thank you all for watching this video today, I appreciate it and have a good one.